All right, it's homecoming week for the Jinx Trojans here at Allen Trimble Stadium, preparing for the Jinx Trojans against the Moore Lions on Friday night at 7.30. Here with Keith Riggs, head coach of the Trojans. Coach, coming off a win against Norman North, what would you like out of your team that you saw against them on a on a long road trip, probably the longest one you're going to take? But, well, I guess you took Enid, right? Enid, they're about the same. Yeah. You know, really pleased with our execution, our consistency uh, throughout the game. We played really well from the start. Um, all the way through the fourth quarter, and uh, you know we're going to need to repeat that week in and week out. Moore's a team coming in; they just lost to Enid, but you're not taking this team lightly at all, are you? No, that, they put up a lot of points. Every game they played, they've scored a lot of points. They've got a really good offense, some good receivers, and so we're going to have to be ready to play. The weather; there's a little crisp in the air. It kind of reminds me that it's actually fall. You got a, you got a favorite thing you like to do in the fall besides football? Well, there's not much time for anything else in the fall <laughs> I guess so, yeah. with right. uh, football. So it's a good thing I like football. Yeah, he's wearing the long sleeves out here. I feel like you're always wearing long sleeves, though. we got to protect ourselves, us yes. pale folks, you know what I mean? So coming up, homecoming. This this team lost your homecoming game last year. How? What, what's your message to your guys this season to know, like, hey, Coach Trimble always used to say to us, the homecoming dance is a lot more fun when you win the homecoming game, right? It is. A, a great homecoming weekend starts with a, a big win. Uh, on Friday night and uh, you know the key is just to put away the the distractions there's a lot of them and and we've had to deal with distractions uh, you know in previous weeks so our kids have done a good job this week preparing so um, I think uh, we're looking for a, a good homecoming win. A lot of me people may be wondering you see this team on Friday nights play like they did against Norman North like they did against Union and it's hard to think that they can lose to anybody. They can beat just about anybody. And what do you think is is the difference between the, the Jinx team we see against Norman North and Union versus the, the teams that, that we see against other people? Well, yes, you, you've seen glimpses of greatness from our team, I think. Uh, coaches, we see it. Our players see it. Uh, the difference in some of the weeks has just been our consistency and our execution. And so, you know, we've, we've tried to work really hard in our practices to – to be more consistent, you know, every rep of every period, and and with that consistency will come, you know, better play week in and week out, uh, quarter by quarter. Do you remember your last homecoming dance? I do not. That was a long, long time ago. <laughs> I was going to ask you what you wore. I feel like you're a ruffles guy, you know, ruffles shirt. You know, that was pretty popular back then. That was, you know, 30 years plus years ago. <laughs> That's right. But uh, yes, uh, but no, I. My memory, I don't know if I've erased it on purpose or uh, or that. just it's been that long. Yeah, who, who knows? But uh, be sure to tune into the game on Trojan TV for free on our YouTube channel. You can also come to the game, kick off at 730. Be sure to check it out. That's going to do it.